Good day everyone! I'm Renren Soberano, a Bachelor in Physical Education student, and I am here to demonstrate to all of you the 8 basic skills in playing badminton, which are the grip, serve, footwork, stroke, smash, drop shot, drive, and the clear. We all know that badminton is a racket sport played using rackets to hit a shuttlecock across the net. Badminton as battle door and shuttlecock is played with sides across a string suspended some 5 feet above the ground. The sports test players' athletic stamina, agility, and good motor coordination skills. The first one is the grip. We have four basic grips. The first one is the forehand grip. It is anything on your rocket side. It's either on the right side if you are right-handed or in the left side if you are left-handed, whether it be overarm or underarm. Your fingers should be loosely around the grip and this is important for all four grips. If you are gripping the rocket too tightly, then it becomes much more difficult to quickly change between grips when necessary in the middle of the rally. A tip grip will also limit your ability to generate control and power in your shots. The forehand grip is used for forehand clears, smashes and drops, forehand drives, forehand lifts, and forehand net shots. The second grip is the backhand grip. It is anything to your non-rocket side, whether it's in, it is on the left or the right side. It is the easiest way to learn the backhand grip if it is set up with your thumb on the top of the wider section of the grip, with your strings facing the floor and ceiling. Your fingers should be relaxed around the side. The backhand grip is used for backhand drives, lifts, net shots, serves, and doubles defense. The third one is the bevel grip. To learn the bevel grip, you can start in your backhand grip and move your rocket head around so that your strings are now facing diagonally and your thumb is on the ridge, bevel. Would you move the rocket anti-clockwise from your backhand grip if you are right-handed and clockwise from this position if you are left-handed? The bevel grip is used for backhand rear core shots, some forehands and backhand net shots, some singles, defense if you are really stretched. And the last one is the pan handle grip, where your thumb and the finger pinch the top of the rocket in order to top net kill the incoming shuttlecock. The pan handle grip is the one that actually comes most naturally to beginners because it's easy to hit overhead shots with butt contrary to what many players use for this. The pan handle grip is used for late backhand rear court shots, retrieving a net cord on the backhand side, some net kills on drives depending on your position and preference. The second basic skills of badminton is the serve. We have four basic serves. The, the first one is the high serve. It is used when you want to force your opponent to run to the back of the court by hitting the shuttlecock toward the rear end of the court. A good high serve will usually save you from receiving a smash from your opponent. The second serve is the low serve. The low serve is used to bring the opponent forward by hitting the shuttlecock toward the front of the court. If you manage to send a fabulous low serve, the opponent would have to dash forward and move under the shuttle to run it. The third one is the flick serve. The flick serve should be used sparingly because it can be fairly easy serve to play if expected. Use this serve no more than once every 5 serves to keep your opponent guessing. Begin the serve the same way that you would when ex executing a low serve. However, instead of gently tapping the birdie over the net, flick your wrist quickly to bring the birdie unexpectedly into your opponent's backcourt. You can use this serve in either doubles or singles, but it is more commonly used in doubles. And the last serve is the drive serve. The drive serve is an extremely risk serve 
but many expert badminton players enjoy it because of the high reward it can yield. Observe your opponent carefully. If you determine that your opponent has a slow reaction time, it is best to throw in the drive serve occasionally, as you are likely to get the point. The drive serve is executed using the forearm underarm actions. It should be a quick serve and the birdie should go low over the net and deep into your opponent's court. Be careful and stay on your toes because if it's your opponent's hits your serve, it will likely come back to your side very quickly. The third basic skills of badminton is the footwork. The footwork is another vital skill for badminton. You have to continually adjust your speed according to the speed of the shuttlecock. The players have limited space to move around. So good footwork is imperative. With proper footwork, you will be able to conserve energy and face shots coming toward you from any direction. The fourth basic skills in badminton is the stroke. We have two basic shots, the, for, the forehand shots and the backhand shots. Forehand shots should be played when the shuttlecock is on your racket side. Your index finger will control your forearm stroke as you swing overarm or underarm. Swing the wrist along with your index finger as support to play a forehand stroke. The backhand shots should be played when the shuttlecock is on your non-rocket side with your thumb controlling the strokes. While playing badminton, your light grip will mean you'll be able to switch between the forehand and the back grip at ease. To play a backhand shot, hold the racket with the back of your hand in front and swing your wrist forward while using your thumb as support. The fifth basic skills in badminton is the smash. A smash is a shot with the power and speed downward to the opponent's court. The angle and the stepness of the shuttle's trajectory will make it hard for your opponent to retrieve contact the shuttle further in front of your body than the clear or the drop shot. The sixth basic skills in badminton is the drop shot. It is a soft badminton shot performed from the rear court. The seventh basic skills in playing badminton is the drive. Drives are fast badminton shots exchanged horizontally right across the net. And the last basic skills in playing badminton is the clear. The clear is the most important badminton shot, especially in a singles game. In a singles game, players use the clear more than any other types of shots. A high defensive clear prevents your opponents from smashing from a good angle. And that was the 8 basic skills in playing badminton. I hope that all of you have learned different skills on my demonstration. Once again, this is Renren Soberano, a Bachelor in Physical Education student, saying good day and God bless us all.